Hey guys, how you doing? Ron Raymond here from the Rain Report with your free NFL preview and prediction on Sunday's game between the Cleveland Browns and the Pittsburgh Steelers. Hopefully you're having yourself a good start to your day. As always, don't forget, if you do enjoy these videos, please hit that like button and subscribe to our channel by tapping that notification bell in the top right hand corner. Alright guys, last game of the uh, NFL wildcard weekend between the Steelers and the Cleveland Browns. Now Pittsburgh a 4.5 point home favorite over and under set at 46.5. ATS forecast, the computer pick, going to lean with the Steelers here in a close one. 22.9 to 20.8, the over-under at 43.7. Looking at the Steelers' last five games, 1-4 against the point spread, 2-3 against the number, 3-2 to the over, where Cleveland coming off a big win last weekend against the Steelers, although they played a lot of their backups, 3-2 straight up, 2-3 against the number, and 3-2 and to the over. Now looking at the value index here on this game, we had Pittsburgh at minus 6.5 and you're laying 4.5. So if you do like the Steelers, you're getting good value here with Big Ben and company. And if you like uh, Nick Chubbs and Kareem Hunt in the running game of the Cleveland Browns, we had them at plus 0 0.69 and you're getting 4.5. So you are getting value on both these teams this weekend. The chance of winning does favor the Steelers at 82.1% based on 15 previous games in the database. And the chance of covering the spread favors Cleveland at 63%. Now, the chance of this game going over the total is at 40%, meaning a 60% chance of this game going under the total. And that's where I think I'm leaning to this game here, guys. When I look at the history of these two teams, uh, Pittsburgh has absolutely dominated Cleveland at home. In fact, Cleveland is 0-10 straight up in those games at Pittsburgh, 3-6-1 against the point spread, 4-6 to the under. And they played here a few weeks ago, and it was a uh, blowout for the Steelers. In fact, uh, they won 38-7. Uh, actually, it wasn't a couple weeks ago. It was uh, October um, October 18th. It was a 38-7 uh, wipeout. And, but you know what? Pittsburgh was only a 3.5 point favorite. Uh, but now they are a 4.5. Uh, so a bit of a 1.5 more than that game. But again, uh, Pittsburgh going into this game. They, they, there are a couple of things you got to keep in mind here. Pittsburgh, just do what you do well. And that's uh, play good defense. And find a running game. You're going to have to find a running game if you're going to win some playoff games. For the Cleveland Browns, if you're the Pittsburgh uh, Steelers defense, do not let Baker Mayfield out of the pocket. You keep the, you keep him in the pocket because when Baker Mayfield is uh, the most effective, it's when he's um, running those bootlegs, those naked boots, play action pass. And if uh, the running game gets going for Cleveland, that's the only way I can see them uh, pulling off the upset this weekend. And again, two things, turnovers and penalties. Win the turnover battle and stay out of the penalties. Do not get bonehead penalties that will cost you a football game. And those are the two biggest things that will hurt a football team to win a football game. Turnovers and penalties. But in order to win football games in the playoffs, you got to play great defense, which the Steelers do. But you got to give the edge to the Cleveland Browns of running the football. They do have one of the best running games in the league. Now, looking at... Uh, let me see the press um, the, the at home and uh, away records for the Steelers. They've done well at home, seven and one straight up, five and three against the number, five and three to the over. And uh, for Cleveland, not a bad year, uh, eleven and five straight up on the season, five and three on the road. So uh, they do have some success playing on the road this season. But uh, it's going to be an interesting matchup here this Sunday. The final game will be a night game, so it'll probably be a cold one in Pittsburgh. So there you have it, guys. Uh, I think the under is where you want to go, under 46.5. And, a half. and uh, let's see what the ATS calculator says on that number two. Yeah, 38.9, and it has Pittsburgh winning by 3.65. So under is the play here, guys. Uh, Pittsburgh and Cleveland. Hopefully, you catch you a nice winning ticket. As always, you can subscribe to this channel by tapping that notification bell in the top right-hand corner. Shop for value. Play those percentages. We'll see you back shortly with another rain report.